what's going on what's going on everyone if you're in here hit that like button comment let us know you're in here what's up super wolf girl how you doing how you doing what's up everybody what's going on man i'm just uh getting on here to give everybody an update of what's going on with the channel and what we got going on what's going on everybody what's up marcos what's up wolverine bullies what's up jason or javen my bad what's up sarah what's up brian what's up jenny yeah what's going on Cass? what's up everybody if you're in here hit that like button um you know comment it and let us know you guys are in here that's what's up that's what's up everybody what's up nathan that's what's up super wolf girl what's up josh p what's up everybody what's up what's up Tim? tim what up big john what's good with you bro but uh but yeah i just was hopping on here to give everybody an update we've been kind of busy these past two weeks we ain't put up no videos i was sick last week and you know we've been kind of slacking so i wanted to hop on here and what's up brazil what's up everybody what's up ryan what's up everyone who watches what's up what's up but uh but yeah <clears throat> like i said you know for the past week we've been pretty you know past couple weeks we've been pretty busy we got a lot of real big things going on a lot of uh you know a lot of stuff coming here soon so you know make sure you guys stay tuned we do have the boss and nina pups we haven't released them yet we'll be getting a video of those here real soon so make sure you stay tuned for that as well and um you know like i said you know we've been pretty busy i've been sick it's been you know it's been a mean one but today we got out got a lot of new video of a lot of dogs we got some video of dark low we got some video of our boy vanilla gorilla we got a lot of stuff uh you know working on a lot of stuff we got some show vlogs coming up for you guys and all that and uh just wanted to get on here and hop on here and hop with you guys and is everything kind of looks like it's lagging a little bit is any is everything cool in here to y'all or what if you guys uh, see any lag or if it looks kind of choppy or anything, please let me know in the comments. But um, but yeah, we still have the Boss and Nina pups. We haven't put them up yet. Like I said, been super busy, but we're going to get some video of them this week. And we'll have that up. We got um, a Chicago show vlog. Going to be one of the best vlogs we put out. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And uh, can you tell us? All right, that's what's up. That's what's up. That's what I want to hear. That's what's up. Um, as far as breedings we got coming up, like I said, we got the Boss and Nina pups. They're like eight weeks old right now. We'll be putting a video up of him them here real soon. And, uh, you know, if anyone's interested in that litter, interested in a puppy off of that litter, make sure you guys get with us uh, when we drop that video. We're going to be having a ground shipper picking up our pup one of the pups off of uh rocco and stella it's gonna be heading out to the caribbean out there to mickey i want to send a big shout out to him for his business the ground shipper will be here within like the next um you know the next week or so so once we drop this video if anyone's interested in getting in it we'll probably be able to get you guys this pup out real soon yeah my number is 217-280-0151 please wait till this live's over to call me but um but yeah man we got a lot of real big stuff coming up man we've uh you know the you know we got a few companies hitting us up they're wanting us to review some of their products so we're going to be putting up some dog products some kennels all types of stuff we're going to be going to get in a p.o box for anyone that's interested in sending anything out you know want us to review just want to send us out anything you know what i mean so we'll be putting that p.o box in the description of all of our upcoming videos so make sure you guys stay tuned for that but um 
But yeah, the Boss and Nina pups are looking real, real nice. I can't wait to get a video of them and show them to you guys. I'm also going to be getting a video of the first pick male out of Napoleon and Nala. And he will be coming available. So if uh, the pups we have right now are going to start at around 15 and will be going up to about 25. So it really just depends on the pick. What's the number? But um, but yeah, we got a lot of real nice stuff coming up, man. We spent all day today taking video, getting video, of, you know, some updated video of some of the dogs you guys have seen, getting some video of dogs you guys haven't seen before. So we got a lot of real nice stuff coming up, man. And uh, you know what? I just figure I'd get on here and chop it up with you guys, man. If any of you, any of you guys got any questions, leave them in the comment section, and um, you know get on here that's what i'm on here for is to holler at you guys answer any questions and all that good stuff but we're gonna be getting back in the um what's up kim kniff no uh david gonzalez we don't have a actually we do have a blue male it's gonna be the first pick male out of napoleon and nala my partner decided to let him go and we're gonna be doing an updated video on that boy here really soon he was the first pick male real badass boy and uh you know i'll be getting some video of those here real soon um we don't have any tri pups available right at this exact moment but we did a breeding with dark low and our girl oh, excuse me with our girl bada bing and um she's looking pregnant and we'll be expecting pups off of that here really soon and you know we're going to be expecting pretty much all tries off of that litter. We might have just some blues, but it, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be predominantly try. So, do you know if there's still gonna be a show this weekend in Lawrence, Kansas? Um, I'm not 100% sure about that, man. One show I do know that's coming up this weekend is gonna be uh, in Colorado. It's right outside of, uh, it's about an hour outside of Denver. If you anybody's in Colorado and wants to go to that show, again, it's like an hour right outside of Denver, and uh, I can give you all the information you need to get to that show. So, uh, yeah, we'll we'll have some we'll have some tries coming real soon, Drew. So make sure you stay tuned. Those pups are probably going to be priced, you know, in the twenty five hundred range around there, give or take a little bit. It really just depends. We don't price our pups until they're born, and we can see what we're looking at. So, um, what about major pain in Napoleon daughter breeding? Um, um, yeah, the, you know, we're going to be waiting on that girl to come in the heat and stuff like that. She just now, just a little bit over a year, we'll be getting some video of them and all that. Bro, shout out from New Zealand. Shout out to New Zealand. Thanks for tuning in, man. We really appreciate it. Big shout out to you guys out there. But uh, I'm looking to get a puppy from you around June or July. Do I got to reserve one or how does that work? I'm fresh out the pen. They call me Murda from OKC. Man, bro, if you're trying to get a puppy, that's not the way to start off, man. But, um, you know, best thing to do is just stay tuned to our videos. And if something catches your eye, give me a call at 217-280-0151 and we'll take care of you. But uh, how much how much is shipping to North Carolina? Shipping is usually about the same, you know, for most places. You're going to be looking around 450, 400, 500, right around there. Sometimes if we got a few pups, we'll, uh, you know, if we got a few pups going out the same way, we'll, you know, we'll, um, we'll get a little bit better deal. So, you know, like if, you know, if I got like, not too long ago, we had three pups go out to the East Coast. Normally, that would have cost them guys about four fifty five hundred, but since all three were going out there, we got them for like two seventy five, three hundred each. I can't remember exactly, but it was a super good deal. So I will get you the best deal I can on shipping. You know, we're not worried about trying to make any money off of shipping or any of that type of stuff. So, you know, we got a lot of real big stuff coming up, man. We got dark low puppies. Yes, Ken Kenneth. Um, we got some real nice dark low puppies coming here soon. I just took some video of that boy today, man. He's looking awesome. 
The boy's maturing really, really well. He's super, man. Just wait till you guys see this boy. But, um, bro, I thought someone kidnapped you, bro. <laughs> nah, we're still here, man. Man, when y'all breeding some more whitehead like Blanco? Um, you know, we will be doing some stuff with white folks here soon, you know. Um, I got a breeding I did with a local breeder around here. There'll probably be some pups available off of that. I'm going to be doing a video with, you know, getting some footage of her. And, you know, here soon we're going to be doing some things with white folks. But we got a lot of up-and-comers that we're going to be doing some real nice stuff with, man. I can't, I got, we got some dogs that I can't wait to show you guys. Like, we got some real nice up-and-coming stuff that we've been holding on to. And like I've told people in the past, we don't really like to bust them out until they're, you know, of age. We don't really want to promote, promote no puppies over here or anything like that because we have a lot of adults to promote at this time. But we got a lot of real nice up and coming stuff, man, that you guys wouldn't even believe. Some badass dogs that I'm, you know, been holding out and holding out just waiting for them to get to that right point. And we'll be busting them out for you guys here soon. And the reason why we do that is, is like, you know, like some video I put up of Dark Low in the past is not the greatest footage of him. You know what I mean? And right now, man, this boy is maturing into something real, real nice. We bred him. He's a Napoleon son. We bred him to a Lucky Luciano daughter, which is our girl Stella's litter mate sister. Um, Bada Bean, real nice female, real nice try girl. We're going to be looking forward to that litter. That's going to be something that's coming here really soon. So make sure you stay tuned for that. I want to drive out and check you guys out. Yeah, man, here this spring, we're going to be having some get-togethers and all types of stuff. So make sure, make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. Um, any females? Um, yeah, we do have some females. We got three females. I'm not 100% sure which girls are going to be available, but we do have some female pups available. When did you guys say you're expecting the tri pups? The tri pups are probably due. I think they're doing like a week and a half, two weeks. She's huge right now, and uh, you know it's gonna. Be, we're really looking forward to that litter. That's gonna be our boy Dark Low's first litter, and uh, you know we can't wait to see what he's doing. What's up, Queen Bay or Queen B? You know, shout out to Louisiana. Thanks for tuning in. All y'all dogs nice. Thanks a lot, Drew. We appreciate that, man. Can't wait to see the update on them. Yeah, that's going to be coming here soon. I got to do some editing and stuff. Like I said, we've been super, super busy. We've been, you know, talking some, you know, got some deals going with some, you know, some companies. I don't really want to put it out there just yet. But, um, you know, like I said, we're going to be getting this P.O. box. If anybody wants to send out anything, you know what I mean? You know, you, you can send out us a drawing of your favorite dog, anything, you know what I mean? So we're going to be putting this P.O. box in uh, the comments of all of our upcoming videos. So make sure you guys stay tuned to that. We're going to be having some people sending out some dog products. Like I said, some harnesses, all types of stuff. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. We'll be doing some reviews and showing you guys a little bit of what these dogs can do, you know, because a lot of people seem to think that they can't do a lot. And, you know, we're going to prove that to you guys. It's been really, really cold and, you know, not so good weather around here. So right now it's just starting to get nice. We got out there today and we, me and my girl, I want to, you know, send a big shout out to my girl, man, because she puts in a lot of work with these dogs and, you know, we don't get her on here too much. And, you know, for those that want to see Alana on the channel, any females on the channel, all that type of stuff, if you guys want to see Alana come on the videos again like she did in the past, leave it in the comments here. Try to motivate her to get on this, get on these videos again. So, greetings from Aruba. Shout out to Aruba. Salute to Connecticut. I want me a pup pop Ninja and Juliet. Yeah, the Ninja and Juliet breeding has already been done. We got something really big planned for Juliet's next breeding. You know, nothing, you know, we just got something uh, something else lined up for her. You know, we usually don't repeat breedings like that. But, um, but, uh, can't wait till I hand cap my cash over for you guys for your lot, fine specimens getting closer and closer. That's what's up, Josh P. And you already know we're going to take care of you, bro. You know, you've been one of the guys, few guys that's been with us from the very beginning of our channel. Like I said, you know, we haven't really been taking 
you know, we just now started taking uh, YouTube pretty serious and stuff like that. You know, we just hit 15,500 subscribers. And I want to send a big shout out to all you guys that show us love on our videos and hit that like button. Share them with your friends, man. We really, really appreciate it. Straight up. And Josh P, big shout out to you, man, because you've always, you know, you've always been on the channel and always showed us love and all that type of stuff, man. You got any champagne color dogs? We got a champagne female out of Boss and Nina. And, um, you know, like I said, we'll be doing that. You know, the, stay tuned for them puppies, man. So, you know, it's some real, real nice blood. It's some more of our old school blood. But the dogs are going to be badass, man. Trust me when I tell you. And wait till you guys see this white folks daughter we got on the low over here. I can't wait to show you guys her, man. She's badass. You got any... At what age do you breed? You know, we usually don't start breeding our dogs till well over a year. You know, sometimes a little bit longer. So, um, nothing under a year. You know, we usually wait on the second heat, if but most of the time on the third heat. You know, but uh, that's when we start breeding them. Males, you can breed males. You know, you can breed a male anything over nine months old, but. We don't do it that soon over here. We're not in that big of a hurry. We have enough dogs that we don't have to, you know, get crazy and use a male that's super young, you know. We'll give them plenty of time to develop so we know exactly what we're breeding to our dogs. Um, Any adult females for sale? Not right at this exact moment, but I think I do have a couple partners that we're talking about um maybe letting a female you know we might have one or two here really soon so make sure you guys stay tuned for that good evening great videos do you guys have any partners in florida will you do any rocco breedings <clears throat> no we don't have any partners in florida and we just had a litter of rocco pups rocco's stud fees ten thousand dollars right now and uh you know, so we probably won't be running back and using him anytime, anytime soon. But um, you never know, man. Best thing to do is stay tuned because we may use him in a, another time. You know what I mean? It's hard telling. We might use one of his sons. Um, we have one of his sons that is definitely going to be getting used. Real badass boy. Make sure after you get done watching this video, you go check out the Rocco and Stella pups. And uh, check out our pick mail that we kept. We're definitely going to be incorporating that blood. You know, now that we got it, you know, with our boy and, you know, our girl and stuff like that, you know, we'll be incorporating that stuff. You know, we don't really like to repeat breedings and, you know, redo stuff. Um, if, if we do, it'll be like an in-house thing. You know what I mean? How can two nice dogs breed something not so nice? I don't know, man. Like, sometimes stuff clicks. Sometimes stuff don't click. You know what I mean? Breed, you know, litters are, you know, it's about luck. You know what I mean? In my opinion, that's the way I look at it. Some breeders might not agree, but, you know, that's the way I look at it. If, uh, you know, sometimes, it's, you know, it's either going to hit or it's going to miss. You know what I mean? And, you know, but... Luckily over here, we've been hitting and hitting and hitting, you know, we got some real nice stuff, man Like I said some of the dogs some of our upcoming stuff that you guys haven't seen before Man, I can't wait to show them to you guys because our dogs ain't doing nothing If you look at the gen, you know the if you go back and look at our throws throwback Thursday videos Or you look at those dogs that are in the pedigrees that we're breaking down and stuff You can see that the dogs are doing nothing but getting better and better and better so just imagine the stuff that we have that we haven't showed you guys. And, um, you know, we're not trying to hold out on you. Just, you know, we're waiting to, for the right times to put out dogs. And like I was saying earlier with Dark Low, you know, some footage that I put up of him before, still good footage and he looked good, but it didn't do him no justice. You know what I mean? Well, this boy's popped since then. And, man, he's looking awesome, man. I can't wait to show him to you guys. Looking for one of your males to bring to Toledo, Ohio. We, like I said, you know, we got the Boss and Nina Puffs. We'll be doing that video this week. So make sure you stay tuned. We're going to have a couple real nice males available off of that litter. You ever breed cats? No, we don't breed cats, bud. Is there a discount on purchasing two at the same time? And the shipping cost for the two? I may just drive out and pick them up if the price is right. 
yeah you know usually yeah if somebody picks up two pups from us we'll cut them a, you know we'll cut them a little slack you know cut them a deal if they buy two at once and usually on the shipping if we got two pups going to the same place we'll get a deal on the shipping and like i said before in this video we'll get any you know we'll we'll do our best to get you know get you the best deal on shipping possible Make sure you go check out our videos and stuff too. For those that are interested in buying pups, we've dropped plenty of videos letting everybody know that, you know what I mean? Like that, you know, people are sending out their money ahead of time. They're receiving their pups. They're receiving everything, you know? So make sure you guys go check out them videos. Yeah. Yeah. Blunt, Blunt Stradamus. Uh, yeah, that, they're going to be coming here real soon, man. Like I said, that's some of our old school blood. It goes back to generations and generations of our blood over here at Killinois Kennels. And, you know, that's some good foundation stuff. So, wait for, you know, you guys make sure you stay tuned for them puppies because they're looking nice. I really need one of them. Yeah, get with us, man. Get with us. Yes, uh, Kremlin. I'm sorry it's getting kind of dark out here. But, uh, yes, we ship, uh, we ship worldwide. We can ship that dog to you worldwide. Now these international sh shippings and stuff, they're a lot, you know, they're expensive. They're more expensive than just shipping in the, in the States and stuff like that. But no matter what, if you're want one of them dogs, we can get it to you. I got some XL bullies, but I love your channel. Keep up the good work. And when the next vid coming out. We're going to be, we're going to get back. We're getting right back at it, man. We're getting right back at it. Like I said, you know, we've been super busy, super busy with just some stuff behind the scenes and stuff like that. Like I said, you know, we've been having some companies hitting us up and, you know, we got a lot of real nice stuff that's going to be coming to the channel. I'm going to be getting a um, PO box and, you know, for, for any companies that are, you know, want to send out their products, have us review them with our dogs all that good stuff so make sure you stay tuned for that what, time? what was your first dog man i've had dogs my whole life man my first american pitbull terrier was uh was a dog named roxy colby american pitbull terrier a real badass female and my first american bully was my boy killinoy kennels debo and if you don't know who debo is Make sure you go check out our Throwback Thursday videos. Go check out some of our stuff. He's a very well-known dog. He's uh, the first dog ever inducted to the Midwest Bully Hall of Fame. He's uh, received uh, lots and lots of awards. So make sure you guys you know, go check that out. Learn a little bit of our history. I'm also going to be working on some more Throwback Thursday videos. I've been slacking on that, man. You know, we had them puppies, them litters coming, and, you know, you know, we got we it got a little crazy over here. We had a lot of stuff, the other stuff that we had to take care of. But uh, what airlines allow bully pups? See, that's the thing, man. It's really hard to ship a dog out through the airlines nowadays unless you do it with like a nanny. You know, that's with somebody that will fly with the dog. You know what I mean? So you, in the United States, we really use ground shippers, and then by sending it to other countries and stuff there's a couple places that will send them out but you know on the airlines by themselves but for the most part you're gonna need a nanny to bring that dog out and it gets expensive depending on where you're at you know yeah orlando florida got great weather yeah yes it does yes it does how do how the rocco puppies doing on me they're doing real good, man. They're doing real good, man. There's, you know, both the boy and the girl are super, super tough, man. I can't wait to see them grow. And, you know, we can't wait to show them to you guys. Now they register them as do other dogs. That doesn't work no more, man. They don't ship no dogs anymore for the most part, you know. That, that you know, using a different breed and stuff, that stuff don't work so much anymore, you know what I mean? You know, some people used to do that back in the day, would put the breed down as a different breed. And, you know, that way the, uh, you know, that way they'd let it go through. But for the most part nowadays, you can't even get them like that, man. No more. I was surprised myself. So, you know, I guess a couple of these airlines had some dogs die. And, you know, just it's just scaring them, 
scaring them to even be dealing with it. Yes, we do got some champagne stuff. We got a real nice uh, champagne female out of the Boston Nina litter. Make sure you guys stay tuned for that. What's up, Bibla Kennels? Uh, what's up, big dog? This is, you know, this live, this, I remember you asking for another live, man. So here it comes, bro. And we're going to start working on doing this more often, man. What's up? I'm from Stockton, California. That's what's up, man. Hey, coming up 420. We got a real big show out there in Sacramento. It's going to be a real good time. If you're interested, you can hit me up at 217-280-0151. And I'll give you all the information you need to, you know, come to that show. I'll be judging that event. So if you want to come out and meet us and get on the vlog and all that good stuff, come on out, man. Shout out to Stockton, California. I need two pups. I'll come get them if you got them. You know, we do have some pups, but, you know, right now the only puppies that we have that are going to be ready to go off of one litter is uh, just off of Boss and Nina. But, um but so you know i don't really think you'd probably want to buy a pup off of the same litter but we do have the dark low and bottom bean pups coming here really soon so make sure you guys stay tuned you're awesome brother love all your videos and knowledge you're dropping thanks a lot man thanks for tuning in and thanks for the love man we really appreciate it what's up dallas elite bullies what's good with you what's good what's good north carolina what's up for that yeah man it's coming man it's coming i'm sorry man like i said you know we've been working on a lot of real nice you know real big big stuff coming to the channel man and you know it's it, it's, it's kept us pretty busy not only that i've been sick for like the past couple weeks or not not past couple weeks but the past week I was really sick there man so you know I've been slacking. I've been trying to get back in the motion of, you know, putting up videos on time and stuff like that. And, you know, we're really sorry that, uh, you know, sorry about that, man. But can you guys see good? It looks like it's getting kind of dark. Can y'all see me? Let me know in the comments. How much is the initial deposit? Yeah, we don't take deposits, man. We do things a little bit different over here. You know what I mean? Um, the best thing to do is subscribe to our channel, hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on our videos. And, uh, you know, once we drop that video of them puppies ready to go, get with us, have your money ready, and we'll get you in there and take care of you. Looking like, looking to get something from you to bring to Toledo to Ohio. Yeah, man, we can make it happen. We can make it happen, man. Like I said, just stay tuned for these upcoming litters. Beautiful dogs. Thanks a lot, coach. We appreciate that. What's up, Brandon? I bet the Rocco puppy is a beast. Yeah, man, he's a monster. He's a monster, and his sister's looking real good, too. And even the pups that we let go off of that litter are looking, looking great. You know, we're going to do a little video of the, uh, of the dog that is heading out to the uh, Caribbean. We'll be showing you guys him before he leaves as well. What's up, Clarence? How's it going, man? Javon Nations. Your dogs look amazing. If I didn't know any better, I would think you're making them in a lab. Much respect in your camp. Looking forward to your upcoming videos. Hey, thanks a lot, man. That really means a lot to us over here. We're glad people are, you know, noticing, you know, noticing the hard work that we're putting in over here, man. And, uh, you know, thanks for the love. That Again, that really means a lot. Illinois is nothing but OGs in the game. Thanks for the love, man. Thanks for love. We appreciate that. Appreciate that. Thanks for the shout out, homie. But thank you for straight up badass content. Thanks a lot for watching, man. If you guys didn't watch and you know give us the support that you did, you know, you know, we probably wouldn't do this. You know what I mean? So thanks for the love, man. And anytime you guys are watching a video and stuff, please hit that like button for us. You know, drop some love in the comment section. We're trying to get this channel blown up this year, man. We've been, you know, you know, we, you know, 15,000 subscribers is, you know, we're, we're, we're happy where we're at, you know, that we got that, you know what I mean? But we feel like we should have, you know, a lot more. And partially, you know, most of that is our fault because we haven't been on YouTube that long, you know, and, you know, sometimes 
you know, we're missing out on posting videos and stuff like that. It's just really hard to keep up with this YouTube stuff, you know, and, uh, but you know, we're going to try our hardest, man. We got a lot of real nice stuff coming up. Like I said, this weather's breaking. The videos are going to be getting nothing but better and better and better. And we're working on new stuff too. So make sure you guys stay tuned, man. And, and again, thanks to all you guys that are subscribed to this channel Everybody that shows us love, man, it really, really means a lot. And, you know, we're going to see how far we can get this channel, man. You know, uh, our next goal is, you know, we want 100,000. You know what I mean? And, you know, we're only a couple, you know, big videos away from getting there, man. So, again, thanks to everybody for the support. And don't forget to show some love on them videos, man, because, you know, we put a lot of work into them and we don't get a whole lot of good return you know, with editing videos and stuff like that. You know what I mean? I mean, of course, when puppies come through and stuff like that, it's a little bit different. But, um, but yeah, man, I think my phone is it's getting dark here. Can y'all hold up? Damn. I think my phone's about to die. But, uh, man, I can't see any more of this stuff. It's getting super dark out here. I was out here just killing some time. But, um, but, um, but man, make sure you guys stay tuned. We're going to be dropping a lot of, you know, a lot of new videos. I just wanted to hop on here, have a little quick conversation with you guys. Anybody that's commented here in the past, like, man, there's tons of comments. I'm sorry guys, my phone's about to die and it's dark as hell out here. But I'm gonna get in, um, I'm gonna, you know, once I get around a computer and stuff, I'll get back and try to, you know, answer any questions I can somehow. We'll work on doing a live, sorry man, I was just killing some time here and I just figured I'd get on here and go live with you guys. But make sure you stay tuned. And again, we got two 420 shows coming up here really soon. One in Sacramento, California, and one in Michigan. I got the information on both of those shows. And if anyone needs to, uh, you know, get there, give me a call at 217-280-0151. Or, you know, you can leave it in the comment section and, uh, you know, check out our Pre, one of our previous videos we dropped the banners i'm gonna drop a video explaining those shows um coming this uh tomorrow i'm gonna you know i'm gonna explain we got the colorado show coming it's about an hour outside of denver this weekend coming up it's gonna be a real good show brc global show and then um you know, 420, I'll be in Sacramento, California at a 420 show out there. It's going to be a real good time. If you guys are in that area and can come out, come out and kick it with us, man. And there's also going to be a real nice 420 show going on in Michigan. And I got all the information you need. So you can hit me up at 217-280-0151. And sorry to catch, you know, cut this one short, you guys. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and get up off here. And again... Big shout out to all you guys. Subscribe to this channel. Shows us love. All that good stuff, man. It really means a lot. And, uh, you know, let's let's try to blow this channel up, man. So, you know, share these videos. Hit that like button, comment, all that good stuff. And thanks for subscribing. Again, we will be dropping the Boss and Nina pups this coming week. And we do have a ground shipper coming so for anyone that's interested in buying a pup off of that litter, we'll be able to get it out to you next week. So make sure you guys stay tuned to those videos. Go back and check out some of our other videos. You know, we got some real good stuff on this channel. We got show vlogs that I'm sure some of you guys ain't seen. We got, you know, a lot of stud videos. We got a lot of real good stuff and nothing but better stuff coming. So make sure you guys stay tuned. And thanks for the love. We really, really appreciate it.